It's become an institution in America. Taco Tuesday, fast food and dine-in restaurants all over the country come up with special deals to bring in taco lovers every Tuesday. But you may not know that the phrase Taco Tuesday is actually already trademarked. And one of the top fast food companies in the nation is petitioning to cancel that trademark. But Chris, one restaurant down the shore says they started Taco Tuesday. Uh, that's right, Jason. Fast food giant Taco Bell is going to court to try and force a Summer's Point restaurant to drop their popular promotion, Taco Tuesday. Here's the problem. Gregory's Restaurant and Bar has been using that phrase since Jimmy Carter was president. For more than 40 years, Tuesday nights at Gregory's Restaurant in Summers Point meant one thing. Taco Tuesday. The three-generation family-run saloon claims this is where Taco Tuesday was born. Back in 1979, it's been taco history ever since. In the first night, we sold 15 orders. Now, we have served over 2 million tacos in these 40-some uh, years. How big is Taco Tuesday here? Well, Gregory's actually trademarked the term back in 1982. It's the only business in New Jersey that can legally use the term in advertising. The Taco John's chain has the trademark in 49 other states. But hold the guac. Fast food giant Taco Bell has filed paperwork with the U.S. Patent and Trademark Office requesting the Taco Tuesday trademark be canceled, claiming no one should have exclusive rights to a common phrase. Why did I get bleeped? Because this is a commercial and there's a trademark on Taco Tuesday. Taco Bell even getting LeBron James to help retire the trademark on social media. Well, it's David Goliath. It, it's uh, the big guy and the little guy. Tonight, customers came out to support the small business the only way they know how, munching on three for a buck tacos. That's big business for you, trying to crush a family-owned, several generations business here. And they're just trying to take the fun away from this uh, establishment. Gregory has now hired a patent attorney to help protect his trademark. The longtime bar owner hoping it doesn't cost him a lot of salsa in the process. The government, this patent office, should realize that the little guy is just as important as the big guy. Now, Gregory's has about a month to respond to Taco Bell's claims, although the restaurant has no intentions of dropping that phrase. They also say they've gotten a lot of a lot of publicity out of this, guys. <laughs> and, and that's right. Uh, it's always good news, right, yeah, if it's, it's in the news. It is good for business. Yeah. Chris, before you go, has Gregory's ever gone after any New Jersey restaurant for using that Taco Tuesday phrase in its advertising? Uh, not officially. Someone locally did try to pull that on advertising. They went to them privately and said, that's our thing. You may hear from our lawyers. Mm. That didn't take long for that to stop. Very interesting discussion. Kind of makes you crave some tacos. Doesn't <laughs> that's it? all. That's all I'm getting out of this <laughs> for sure. You know, Chris had some tonight. All right. All right, Chris. Thank you.